Okay, this is an update on Dr. Stifler's uh, SEC Exciter 18-1 and the Near Infinity Light System experiment that we ran for him. Uh, we ran nine LEDs for a week, five days. I ran mine out to nine days. And I had um, less than half an amp or half a volt drop in a six volt battery for the week. And I've added to it uh, something that he's talked about, and I just ran an experiment to see something here. If I put a little tiny solar panel on this thing, those are 3.5 volt, uh, 70 milliamp hour um, miniature solar panels put together. Um, it uh, It's quite interesting. Uh, there's my uh, voltage on the little panel that I built. There's the amp draw on the SEC right now. You can see it's uh, on the milliamp scale, and it's a 7.60 ohm milliamps. That's all it's drawn. And I have this tuned down quite a ways. These are not uh, completely bright, but they're probably bright enough to see around the room at night for a week, which is what I did, and I'm still doing it. Anyway, there's the voltage on the solar panel. There's the amp draw. Now what I'm going to do is hook up the panel and watch the amp draw. It's going to go the other direction. You're going to see a minus pop up here right in front of that. Okay, now see the minus right here? What's happening now is I've got 14.3 milliamps feeding back into the battery from that little solar panel that pointed up to the skylight right there. That's coming into the house through a filter the skylight onto that little solar panel right there and that's the voltage on the battery right there uh, 6.33 and this will climb up because I'm actually putting energy back into the battery so my thought on this as was Dr. Stifler is you don't need a whole huge solar panel to make light and keep it going and I, I really think this is a winner um, his idea of just using a solar energy to augment the SEC and make it work uh, using solar energy. And um, like I say, that's that minus that's right there is the energy flowing into the battery from the solar cell. Let me disconnect it. I'll show it go the other way again. Okay, there it goes the other way. Now I'm drawing seven point. 76 milliamps out of the battery. You can see the solar panel standing voltage went up to 12 again. And get that to show up on the camera. Yeah, 12.04 on those uh, three little cells there. But uh, yeah, that's a 70 milliamp panel is all that is. But it's enough to make this thing swing into the positive. There it goes positive again, 14 milliamps flowing into the system. And if you left this up for, you know, I don't know how many hours per day in a sunny spot in your house, even inside the house, this would run for a long, 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 long time. And uh, this is quite something. This is Dr. Stifler's uh, SEC Exciter 18-1, and it's the Near Infinity Light System that um, we've been working with and that's the update for today is energy flowing back into the system from that little solar panel inside the house